Hello, everybody, and welcome back to Beta Days. I'm Beanin, and today we're going to take a break from the survival stuff and just build around here. You know, we've got to do a few projects, um, stuff like that, um, and kind of clean up Riverton. You know, last episode we got our butt kicked by uh, the warden, and there's multiple spawners for the warden. So we defeated one and then had to call it quits. <laughs> had to call it quits because, well, you know, it was just, it, it was just a mess. Um, so we won't be dealing with that <laughs> anymore. Uh, this episode, I'm hoping to achieve a few things. Uh, namely, number one, filling out uh, these sections right here, building you know, more buildings and stuff. Um, yeah, I think, I think I'm going to go ahead and continue building on like a few houses right here. I know I need it. And I know the village is in need of some more uh, infrastructure such as this because, well, let's be real. Uh, <laughs> the, uh, what is it? The village is pretty dark right now. Um, we keep losing villagers and, you know, all that in a bag of chips. So, sit back, relax, grab your snacks, and enjoy, and my cartographer died. Okay, cool, that's fun. Starting off today, I'd like to work on this area because it's kind of empty. It's kind of hard to develop uh, when you think about it because this library is big and long, and then this area right here is pretty quiet, so I think I'm going to... Okay, <laughs> I think I'm going to make a back alley here uh, and then kind of, you know, format this area a little or format, lay out this area a little bit with uh, some houses and such. All right. So for the buildings here, I think I'm going to uh, kind of have this sort of a layout. So we got one there, one here, and then a small little house right here. Uh, back here won't really be. Uh, too much to worry about. I can add like, I don't know, a bush <laughs> or something, but this is going to be a little house. And then here's going to be two buildings uh, that I think should be okay. Um, well, okay in terms of, you know, space, but here I think I'm going to do one of the uh, lovely little uh, things right here. So one, two, three, four, and then make sure I have, so there's the stair, glass, glass, stair, and then here we go. So this is gonna be my height. Uh, speaking of which, I'm gonna have to fix this, but I'm gonna go ahead and kind of flesh these out, let them, let them uh, get framed, and then we'll move on from there. All right, so I've got these three buildings uh, all framed up and I've got this little house. It's going to be a weird little one, but I think it'll look uh eight. I think it'll look good in the in the end. We'll have to see. Um you know, nothing too crazy, but I did want to give like some space in between these. I think this is all just going to be one roof. Uh these aren't supposed to be here. These will be stairs, but to the time or the thing that I wanted to get uh take a look at is see how these blocks all look. You know, the new uh, tough block. So we'll just make one of each to start off with. Um, and I'll just do like each texture and we can kind of see what they look like because I do want to use, uh, these new blocks in my builds, but I'll have to see, you know, what looks good versus the normal texture because tough on his own or tough on its own is pretty ugly. Uh, but yeah, there's a few things you can use to let it break up. Okay, so this is what we're working with. Okay, I think definitely the bricks are good. These ones are good, I guess, for bigger scale things. Uh, let's have one more smooth. Actually, let's do two of each. Just because I want to see how they like connect up. Okay, and then a brick. Is that it? Uh, oh, nope, I need this one. And then anything else? Nope. Okay, so right here, then 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> Not what I wanted. There's that. And then here's this. Okay, I'm starting to notice. Hmm. Okay. So there eh. It's alright. I think the brick is the tech best texture. Um so I think for the bricks, I honestly might do I might do the varying textures down here at the bottom. Uh well no, I might like do tough here, um wood here, and then I guess the terracotta right here. This is a weird little house. Um but I think I can like do something like that and then have you know these right here. Yeah, you know what? Let's 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 fill let's fill in these walls on the bottom and see what see what what see what these look like. There we go. So now that I've had some time to build with this block, I just used it on this one because it's the smallest house, uh, least resource intensive, and I can decide kind of what it looks like in the grand scheme of things. I think that you know it's not a bad material. Um, I definitely need to like break up the textures in different areas if it were a bigger building. Um, like right there, I can just fill that in. Uh, but I think for a small villager house, this is perfect because it's just gonna have one bed here. Um, and then a little upstairs area for the villager. And I don't know, you can sit here and twiddle his thumbs uh, based on, you know, <sighs> <laughs> whatever but I, I i enjoy i i think this is a good look but for these i'm going to let's see i think i'm gonna have a break in the texture here so on this lower part i think i'll have some of this you know what maybe i'll just do different colors uh on the bottom all around now on this floor it'll have to be yeah, actually, wait, no, I can, this can be a window. I mean, it's not going to be a great window. Uh, oh, yeah, because this one can be the stairs. Cool. So I think what I'll end up doing here is just, I don't know, kind of finding a happy medium. I'm not trying to make these be like the best buildings in the world, but I want them to look nice. So just go ahead and get what, uh, Get what I need done. Quick status update. Um, I've put in the floors for these buildings. Kind of tried to break up the textures a little bit. Um, and I also switched out this to a brown just because, well, I don't know. I I think it would it'll look nice. Now, uh, huh. So for this one, I think right here I'm gonna do this my usual stripped uh birch, but then. For uh, up here, I don't know what I'm going to put. Uh, I could do the orange, but that doesn't really go together. Uh, da, 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 da. Could always do planks. That's a weird texture or color. Uh, I'll have to figure out. Maybe if I just piece it down, piece it like one by one here, you know, we'll figure it out. But I do also want to get the floors in. And I'm having trouble figuring out what I want to do for the floors. Uh, so we'll see. <laughs> I, I'm not 100% sure yet. Morbid curiosity here. I wonder what pink would look like. Um, I mean, I don't think it would look great, but when you look at... Uh, yeah, let's just put that there. And what does that look like? I mean, it looks okay, but uh, I might have to go check out the Mesa biome and get another um, chunk of white terracotta. You know, have have something like that. Um, yeah, yeah, I might have to do that. But for this one, I'll just do the birch and then I'll go get some more terracotta for here. Oh, yeah, I was looking at the floor, too. <laughs> Uh, you know, honestly, for these upstairs floors, I think I'm gonna, I think Spruce is really calling my name, honestly. So, especially for this one, this one, this one should be like a Spruce Dark Oak type beat. So I'm gonna go get some Spruce wood and we should be able to. So before I get started on 
uh, this upstairs section. Why didn't I frame that? Oh, well. Uh, before I get started on this upstairs section, I, oh yeah. I think this, um, I think I'm going to fill in these floorboards so that we have, you know, something uh, to work with, uh, something to stand on. And honestly, I'm really liking uh, the way this looks right here. Now, the question here is, oh, is going to be, do I need, uh, what's it called? Do I need to change up, you know, these areas? And speaking of which, I can get this out and this can be wood. Or, that was not English. Do I need to kind of uh, change out like what this material is going to be compared to over here? Should I just keep the birch going the whole way? I want them to be different, but I don't want them to be like too different, if you know what I mean. Like, these ones right here, they're all kind of like the same color. Um, they they vary a little at the bottom, but, you know, once you get up here, they're kind of like the same shade. So I think I want to do something like that. Something that's not too drastic. This is its own standalone thing, but these buildings here, you know, it really is, I don't know, it's going to come down to what I choose up here. And I think, I think honestly, if I do birch here, I think the white terracotta will be a perfect fit right here. So let's go ahead and see. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> and then let's fill this in and we should be good to go. I'm gonna grab more materials right after this. And then, uh, yeah, actually, well, I think the only thing I need to grab after this is, what's it called? Uh, the terracotta, so if that's all I need to grab, then I don't know, we might be in business. Now, the question is, should I decorate these or what, you know? <laughs> I mean, it's mostly just going to be villagers living in here, but, you know, sometimes I like to find a use for these, and I think if I put... Yeah, if I put stairs right there, I'm not going to be able to fit, um, which is fine. But I will be able to put something there. I don't know. But the floors are done. I'm going to go ahead and fill this in uh, and then grab uh, some white terracotta for this other building here. Right here. <laughs> I don't know what it's going to be, but I went ahead and got some new. Uh, well, not new, but. I got some lovely, lovely white concrete so we can, okay, not do that. Put this up here. And I hope this is enough. That was a decently far trip that I had to make. I think it should be. Uh, let's do these parts first because that'll be the telltale sign of what we need and what we don't need. I think for this house, well, for these houses specifically, I'm trying to figure out what I'm going to do with the roof because the roof is going to be a little tricky. Uh, okay, well, I know that these can just be... Oh, wait, no, these are going to be... Yep, yep, yep. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Thought this was going to be something else, but nope, it's not. There we go. What was that? I don't care. <laughs> uh, but yeah, for here... It's I'm not going to place that there. I, I'm trying to figure out what to do with the roof. Do I do one big one or three small ones? I don't really know. It's one of those things that uh, it's unfortunately not up to me now. I could do this as like the world's smallest balcony, but I think I'm just going to stick with something like this. Make it easy on myself. Um, but there's that. And so I guess... The last part is going to be the roof. Okay. Hmm. Now, how I'm going to do this, uh, well, it, it'll be interesting, but I think I'll figure it out. And don't worry, I'm not going to record myself doing the roof. I know that's a decently boring... Uh, uh, a decently boring, I guess, task to watch. And wow, I really used all of uh, what I was... 
Okay. But what I was going to do, but here I can... Is this even? Yeah, this is even. Here I can go boop, boop, boop. There's that. Uh. Eh. Wait. <laughs> Hold on. I don't know if this is gonna work. Is it? I'm not sure. Nah, I'll figure it out. So I ultimately decided to just uh have okay, well that's not gonna go anywhere. I ultimately decided just to have uh one big roof that kind of just feeds out of you know all different shapes here. So as you can see, oh wait, I forgot that I still needed to do that. Okay. <laughs> I've been doing a lot of falling in here. Um, but as you can see, I just started tracing like uh all the dormers out from one main roof, and then we have this center shape right here, which honestly I think this is the best one that I could have gone for. And yes, I see that stair in there. Um, I have plenty of deep slate, so I don't think I will need it. But I think this will be a great looking roof in terms of, uh, I mean, where we're at <laughs> in the village. Uh, it'll add a nice little shape um, and everything, and I do need to, uh, where to go? Yes, I do need to get down here and do a little bit. I forgot about this area, <laughs> as you can tell. But right here, I just need a quick little, almost like dormer. Not even dormer. Uh, okay. I hate it when that happens. But it's not a dormer. What is it? A uh, little roof section. Yeah, we'll just call it that. <laughs> and then after that, sir. Okay. <laughs> now he decides that he's going to be a stonemason when you know there's one over there um yeah i think that looks good i'm gonna have to you know do some finishing touches but obviously that'll be that'll come later and i also can't forget to do this section right here i might just go ahead and do this throw you up there and then get a little bit of okay <laughs> get a little bit of uh, roof action right here. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Okay. So I'm just gonna fit the bit. Yeah. Sorry. I'm just gonna finish that up, and then we'll go from there. I need to figure out what to do up here. I think maybe I should just do like this, and then and then like ah, whatever. Uh, yeah, it's fine. I'll just do it like this. There we go. Sweet. Okay, now onto the other one. Stop looking at me. <laughs> now onto the other one, and then we'll wrap things up uh, on the building, and then we'll wrap things up for the video. Now for the final touches up here, we're going to add uh, our lovely little window panes. No, not panes. Uh window divots i guess to these buildings uh, well i guess it's one building but eh, you never know who knows uh okay that's not what i wanted oh no my lie has been <laughs> discovered but yes we'll be adding these in and then putting in the glass i was running around looking for my glass and i was like where did all my glass go and then i remembered ah yes i uh i sold it all to the villagers so that was a fun realization. So we've got that glass cooking up. Um, and while that's cooking up, we'll... Uh, we can get our... Oh my gosh. Ugh, I always need scaffolding. We can get our... Window divots, I guess, set up for it. And then move from there. I think, honestly... Uh, wait, what do I need? Oh, yeah, you. I think, honestly with these it shouldn't be too much of an issue uh in terms of looks i know you're probably like what shouldn't be finish a sentence <laughs> but yeah in terms of looks i we shouldn't have too many issues i think this will look fine 
Um, I mean, if not, who cares? <laughs> a villager is going to live here. So, yeah. Minimal effort there for the villagers, but I do still want it to look decent. I mean, because I do have to walk by these things at the end of the day. This should be enough to finish things up, and I'll go ahead and decorate the interiors of these buildings uh, off camera, mainly because... Well, it's been a long day. It's not late, but <laughs> the first two episodes I did were very survival intensive. And remember, I do record these in one day, and that's usually Sunday. So you may have seen three episodes spread out throughout a week. But in reality, this has all been one day's work. So let's uh, make sure that everything's looking good here. Fill in these last little bits of glass. And I think up here should be fine. Oh, cool. Okay, fill in these last little bits of glass. And then later on, I can come back around and fill in uh, areas around here. Well, not fill in areas around here. Sorry about that. Um, go, like, furnish these because I think these are... I, I, I need to know what these are going to be, but I want to furnish them. I'm kind of getting to the point where you know, in the let's play world where I can start furnishing things now, you know, it's something I can afford. So up here, I'm just going to leave this like blank for now. <laughs> um, have a light up here. So nothing horrible spawns, not going to put any beds in here right now. Uh, that's fine. Um, not going to put any beds in here right now because I don't want villagers up in here, uh, in case, you know, zombie comes, but you know, it, the zombie will probably chase the villager out. And then I have actually put some work into here. You know, this place, this little house has become a nice little tiny uh, starter home. And I think it's honestly just like this one. <laughs> this one might be the best one for how small it is. I don't know. I, I think I, I the palette on this one is really good. But we'll go ahead and wrap everything up uh, today for this uh what is it episode and then we'll call it a day and i'll see you in the next episode but anyway guys thank you all for watching today i hope you enjoyed today's episode it might be a little shorter than usual but who cares <laughs> i got what i needed to get done in the time frame and i don't want to keep you guys here for more than you need to be uh please remember to leave a like and a comment it helps out the channel it helps out my videos and remember to subscribe if you're new. I post videos every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday with random streams and videos in between. Until next time, this has been Back to Beta Days. I'm Beanin. Peace.